So the concrete's gonna come up flush with this. I put these cross members in right here to tie the two outsides together. That keeps it from spreading. But also, so I can screw a two by four in right there. So that'll be below the surface an inch and a half of the concrete. And what that does is once this is done drying, we'll take all this off and then there'll be a groove the size of a two by four in the footing. And then when you pour your wall, your wall actually is locked in to the footing. So hydraulic pressure um, can't, e can't as easily push your wall off your footing. Um, it also keeps water from penetrating. If you just had a flat surface and you pour your wall on there, there's gonna be a, a seam, a weak point there.